to normal. In my last video, the lighting was kind of weird. I don't really know why, but it was, so I'm sorry. <laughs> So today I am doing my January haul of the month because I do hauls of the month of every single makeup item I gather up, accumulate during the month of the month. During the, during, during the month. So, yeah. So I have it in two, three categories. Lips, eyes, and face. Or random. Face and random. So let's get started. Okay, so... Starting out with lips, now I have to admit, I did use some of these. I'm actually wearing three of them right now. That is in my defense, you'll see why. They're so pretty in my own defense. Okay, so I'm gonna start out with this lipstick. This is by Ellen Tracy. This is a lipstick that is so pretty. It's like a purpley tone. It is so gorgeous and yeah, it's kind of sheer. Sorry, I'm blinding you. It's kind of sheer though, which is kind of annoying. Kind of annoying. I'm wearing it on my lips today, but I have another lipstick over top of it. It's just, it's kind of sheer. That's what it looks like. It looks a lot more purple on camera. It's just very sheer in real life. It's very, very sheer. So the next thing is from my friend Sarah, and she actually gave this to me for Christmas or my birthday, either one. But it's an LA Colors Lipstick Duo, and honestly, I haven't used it yet on myself because I can definitely see myself using these colors more in the summertime than right now. But, um, actually, maybe I could see myself wearing that in the winter next year. Since it's kind of becoming fall now. Since it's kind of becoming fall now. Wow. Wow. So it's kind of becoming um, spring now. Well, not really, but it's going to be spring soon. So I'm kind of getting into my spring tones things. Yeah. But yeah, that's super pretty. So this is what the lipstick set looks like. It's really matte. Well, it looks very matte on camera. In real life, it's very, um, it's not sheer, but it's kind of sheer with a tad bit of glitter, I think. And then I have the lip gloss next to it. I don't know if you guys can really see it. See, right there. I have the lip gloss next to it. But I really like this, and thank you so much, Sarah. So the next thing is a lip gloss, and I have two. Um, I showed you guys one of them, but I never showed you guys the rest. So this is a Ellen Tracy lip gloss, and it's just, it, this one is very sheer. It has a tad bit of like orange and pink. The next thing is another lip gloss and it's from Ellen Tracy. This has been my absolute favorite lip gloss. Um, it's a really, really good lip gloss. Out of the um, three. But here is this one. Yeah. yeah. This one is this and that one was the other one. And then that's that purple lipstick, that's the LA Colors one, and then that's the lip gloss for the LA Colors. The next two things are from Sarah again, and these are lipsticks. They are from Ulta, and they are the Ulta Matte Lip Crayon. So she gave me one in Raspberry Rose and Hazy Pink. Raspberry Rose is definitely my shade for winter time. It's just so, such a berry tone and I love it. Cause you guys know me and my berries, we are. We are a perfect match. And then for pink rose, hazy pink. Why did I think it was pink rose? Did, did that just fall off? <laughs> what? <laughs> You're gonna like that never just happened. All right, for hazy pink, it's definitely a really pretty, like, summery shade. I don't know. That's super pretty though. Two things are from Wet n Wild and these are the Wet n Wild Fergie lipsticks. So I have this one which is in the shade Fergie Daily and this is like my absolute favorite lipstick now. This is so pretty. Can we just... That is so pretty. Yeah, I'm wearing it on my lips right now. And then the next one is Sarah Gina. I, I'm not even gonna try to say that. Um but it's just like a deep, that's one swatch. Can you, let's do two, two. Yeah, it's legit. I'm obsessed with the Fergie lipsticks. 
if you can find these, definitely get them. They are worth the buy. That is Fergie Daily, and that is the Sarah Fina thing. The next thing is also from Sarah, and this is a Milani lipstick in Flirty Fuchsia. I love Milani lipsticks. They are so bomb. This is super pretty. I also love the smell of them, personally. I don't know if other people hate the scent. One swatch. And that's three swatches. It's right there. So that was Friggy Daily. That was for Sarah Gina thing. And then this is Flirty Fuchsia. I don't know, I love Milani lipsticks. The packaging is adorable. It's just such a good lipstick. So the next two things are, well, I'll show you one. So the next thing is a Rimmel London lipstick. No, we're good. I don't like how Rimmel, Lon Rimmel London lipsticks smell. This one does not smell very nice. But this is in the shade, what shade is it in? Oh, yeah. It's in pink blush, so it's really pretty. Um, this could be also really perfect for spring because it's such a pretty pink. I don't know. I'm kind of obsessed. Like, it's such a pretty, like, spring color. This Lancome Juicy Tubes lip gloss. And it's so pretty. Personally, I think it's gorgeous. It's a tad sticky, so if you don't like sticky lip glosses, stick away from it. Get it? <laughs> Puns. Okay, so thankfully, the next drawer that I'm going to show you actually comes out. Um, okay, so... This is an eye drawer, so eyeshadows, eyeliners, mascaras. So the first two things I'm gonna show you are eyeshadows, and these are also from the Fergie collection from Wet n Wild. I know this collection has been out for a while, but honestly, I think the Fergie collection is like amazing. Like she did such a good job. So this is like that color. Um, so these are all of the colors. Also, oh, I, I, do they have names? Yeah, this one is a Duchess Lounge and this one is Metrolian Nights. So Metrolian Nights is kind of the same concept. It's more of a night out look as well. So or you could even I don't know. Ones. So um I'll just get over with the eyeshadows, I guess. So I have three more eyeshadows to show you. So two are from Ellen Tracy. Um they're like the little paint pots. I didn't really like one of them, not these ones. These ones are so much more pigmented than the other one I tried. This one is silver, and here's what it looks like. The other one that I tried wasn't really that pigmented, but then again, it wasn't really that pigmented on my eye. It was very pigmented on my hand, but not that pigmented on my eye. And like in person, I couldn't see it. But when I went back and edited the video, I could totally see it. And I was like, <laughs> bleh. Yeah. But I can see it in person, so what's the point, you know? So the next one is kind of this greenish, pearly color. It's so pretty. Oh, that's like an icy, like, green. That is gorgeous. That is so pretty. Next is this uh, LA Colors Baby Pop Eyeshadow. I got my friend Sarah one, because I was gonna get her two, but I actually picked up the same one. So, yeah. But it's like a rusty, not rusty. I wouldn't really call it rusty, would you? It's kind of like a metallic, you know, copper color. And the packaging is like adorable on this thing. And I think this is like, and this is in the shade Golden. Golden. The next two things are shadow sticks. So they're from Ellen Tracy. They don't have a thing. They're just shadow sticks. So one is obviously kind of like green gold. One is silver. So the greenish gold one is kind of more olive-y. But I guess it's kind of the same. Besides, this is a lot more gold. The pen is a lot more gold. I don't really have good luck with eyeshadow pens, so... And then there's also the silver one, which is a lot more silver than that. So the next couple things are eyeliners. So I have this eyeliner and it's from Wet n Wild. It's just a black eyeliner, basic black. 
Then I have this liquid eyeliner. It's from Ellen Tracy. It's kind of brown, like in the tube it looks like, but let's see what it looks like. Ew, this is very liquidy. Like it almost feels like it could drip. The next thing is this Wet n Wild H2O Proof Liquid Eyeliner. Now this seems, I've tried this once. Look how black that is. Um, I've tried this once. It was a really good eyeliner. Besides it was so freaking hard to get off so I haven't used this since. But then I have this LA Colors Eyeliner Pencil. I'm not gonna swatch it because it's closed. Okay, so the last drawer. Okay, so moving on to random and also face. So I said in my makeup tutorial video that I actually ran out of my foundation while I was using it. So I picked up a new one because I was curious to try it. This is a CoverGirl CG Smoother Hydrating Makeup um, Foundation. And mine is in buff beige. The next thing is this CoverGirl Concealer. This is super light. And the thing about this concealer, it's also because I ran out of my concealer, but the thing about this concealer is that it, if you don't get it right then and there, it kind of like, you know, it gets stuck and it's super annoying. So I have to do like one eye, completely done. Then the other eye, then my blemishes. And oh my gosh, it's so annoying. The next thing is another Wet n Wild Fergie product. And this is a bronzer. And this is in Carnival in Rio. This is like literally the most beautiful bronzer you may have ever seen. Like, I think that is really pretty. So the next thing is from Sephora. I saw this, it was on the sale aisle, and I was like, I wonder if that even works. So I ordered it, and they were okay. You have to wipe them off after you use your brushes. Like you wipe them on this little like thing. It comes in like, um, it comes in like a little packet like this and then it comes out like a little cloth and then you wipe out your makeup if you guys want to see me do like a first impressions on this let me know and then of course because i ordered it i got three samples i gave the cologne to my grandpa this kate summer eve exfoliate kate it's an exfoliating treatment and it's a hollywood's two minute uh facial so I got a little sample of that, and then the next thing I got was this Experience Fresh Strawberry Sea Berry Moisturizing Face Oil, and it's just like this, and then like it's like a little oil thing. I don't know. It seems pretty cool. Um, and then of course Fergie again. This video is not sponsored, by the way. Just pointing that out there. Then I have two more of these nail polishes. This one I'm like constantly wear constantly constantly wearing in my videos. So if you see it in my videos, then you. You know where it's at. You know. And then there's like this one, which I don't really recommend because I don't really know how to use it. <laughs> I don't really use glitters that often. It just came in like a kit. But as you can tell, there's like glitter. And it's like strawberries and I don't know. It's weird. Strawberries? Did I see? That's amazing. Okay, cool. So I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. If you did, remember to give it a big thumbs up. See me in this outfit next week on Tuesday. Then you know that I'm pre-filming. So I will see all of your beautiful faces Tuesday. Bye guys.